Order turns to anarchy at a maximum security penitentiary when tensions collide between the most treacherous superpowered criminals and the prison staff in the new movie Corrective Measures. It's based on the graphic novel of the same name premiering today on Fox's free streaming service, Tubi. Actor Tom Cavanaugh, who plays Gordon Tweedy, a.k.a. The Conductor, joins us this morning to talk more about this new movie. Tom, how are you doing? I'm well, thanks. How are you doing? Doing well. Thanks for coming on. So your character, The Conductor, I thought it had something to do with trains. Has nothing to do with trains. You are a conduit for electricity. It has nothing to do with trains unless the train's electric and you blow it up, my friend. Then it right. has something to do with trains. <laughs> right, that's true. Uh, so talk about your, your character and how he ended up in, in this prison that basically holds supervillains, monsters, cyborgs, and, and your powers are being inhibited when you're there. You know, you, you should be the PR person for this film because you summed it up so okay. succinctly just now. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I can do a better job. Okay, okay. That was wonderful. Thank I'm you. like, I'm gonna steal your, I'm gonna steal your verbosity. That was tremendous, thank you, thank your, your erudite. <laughs> I, um, yeah, and so I played Gordon, the conductor, uh, Tweedy, who's, um, he's a long suffering and long standing resident of San Tib, which is this max security prison that we find ourselves in. Rooker is the guy that runs it. Uh, he's crooked. And then you've got Bruce Willis as the, probably the most powerful um, in terms of brain wattage uh, criminal that's behind bars along with me. I kind of have the moral center of the, uh, of the prison and I'm helping uh, some of the new guys find their way and not get killed until at one point, like many people who can conduct electricity and can blow things up, I've had enough and decide to do that. Yeah. And corrective measures, you mentioned it there. It features the great Bruce Willis. You know, he plays a character called The Lobe super genius. Of course, Bruce Willis has been getting a lot of much deserved love from movie fans all over the world lately after announcing his retirement. What was it like working with him? And I guess this was one of his final roles before retiring. Well, it's a testament to uh, the kind of career that I think most people aspire to as an actor. You know, th this is a this is a guy that put in three decades plus of prominent and significant roles, which is, a, if you think about it, quite a rarity. Moreover, um, he started in television. I think a lot of your uh, listeners might be too young to remember a show called Moonlighting, but I remember you know, watching this and watching the command as a, as a young actor, watching the command that he had while not speaking and thinking, I don't know what he's doing, but I kind of can't take my eyes off him. Uh, I, we didn't know at the time that he was going to go on and star and star and die in the Die Hard series and all these other different movies. Um, but I, as a young actor, I noted how he had the command of the screen. And of course, that became uh, common knowledge. Um, and getting a chance to share a screen with somebody who's um, kind of put in that time and uh, has laid down some of the lessons that a lot of us have followed uh, is a real privilege. Yeah, I remember Moonlighting. I was, I was very young. I wish it was streaming somewhere so I could kind of start from the beginning. Uh, talk Same. About, Same. Yeah. Talk about uh, anything else that we need to know. It's, it's on Tubi and it's debuting today. Well, you said a great thing when you did your intro. You said free. Right. <laughs> so, <It's> free. <laughs> you know, um, I think over the pandemic, a lot of us have gotten into like the, you know, the thing that streams on your on your television, you know, and this might be a nice uh, movie to settle in with tonight. And I think that's kind of what we're aiming for with corrective measures. You know, it's a uh, I think a, it's sheer entertainment. You know, it's a it's a it's. It combines a couple of genres, the the classic prison break movie with, of course, you know, uh, the, the, the Marvel big screen superpower uh, genre. And so, you know, combining those two things, it's kind of basically a win win. You add free to the top of it and two E coming out today. It's like, well, you're doing pretty good. Awesome. Tom Cavanaugh, Corrective Measures. Check it out today on Tubi. It's free. Thanks, Tom. We appreciate you. Thank you.